Tonight, a dog owner mourns her best friend in Cheatham County. Now she's trying to find the person who shot a marble into her car and killed her dog. Now the sheriff's office has more deputies patrolling that area. Our Jolyn Bukovac has an update from that dog owner and law enforcement. That dog owner is heartbroken after what happened to her dog Joey when they were driving down the street and someone shot a marble into their car. This happened exactly one week ago today. And I'm just so freaking sad. You know, I just can't make the sadness go away. Becky Ingle says she's having a tough time wrapping her mind around what happened to her dog. There's no way I'll ever feel the void that he filled up because he he filled everything. The two shared a special bond. He was, like I keep saying, the first thing and the last thing every day for 10 years that I spoke to. And he wasn't just a dog. He was he was part of my family. Engel says last Wednesday morning, Joey was sitting next to her in the car when a pickup truck swerved towards her on Thomasville Road. And I heard like a poof. And it didn't think nothing of it, thought he hit my mirror or even threw a firecracker at me because it was the day after the 4th. She thinks someone in that truck shot a marble through her open window, hitting her dog in the head. When as soon as I turned left, Joey's head just flopped over. She rushed him to the vet and tried to save him, but the injuries were severe. There's so many things <laughs> that, that I would want to say and, and tell him, but... Ingle says Joey passed away right before his 10th birthday. I was just telling him that I love him and I miss him more than anything in the world. And I'm so sorry about what happened to him. She's hoping the person that killed Joey is held accountable. Ingle has been in contact with the sheriff's office and they say they need a tag number to be able to track down the driver of that truck. Reporting in Cheatham County, I'm Draylen Bukovac, WSMV4.